How are mushrooms grown? There are thousands of types of mushrooms in the world, but only a small number are grown on farms. Thanks to high-tech facilities like Mike's, here in the UK we now grow many of the mushrooms we eat ourselves. And button mushrooms are the most popular. The process begins in a laboratory in Holland where the seeds, or spores, are planted in a special soil, which is then transported to Mike's farm, arriving two weeks later. Once the soil has arrived at Mike's farm, it is put carefully onto shelves in sealed tunnels. Here, Mike's team can maintain the perfect growing conditions for the mushrooms. It's a bit like mimicking the patterns of nature, but speeding the four seasons up. Mushrooms in the wild grow best just after an autumn storm, so this is what the team will be aiming for. Mushrooms are not fruit and they are not vegetables. In fact, they aren't plants at all. They are a type of fungus. A fungus is a different kingdom of organisms to animals or plants. There are many different types of fungi, but not all are as tasty as button mushrooms. Green vegetables grow under different conditions to fungi. Unlike plants, which need sunlight for photosynthesis, mushrooms can grow equally well in the dark or the light. Like us humans, Mushrooms breathe in oxygen and breathe out carbon dioxide. And also, just like us, they need regular water to grow. Did you know that a mushroom is 95% water? 16 days after the soil arrives onto the farm, the mushrooms have popped up through the soil and are ready for harvest. Amazingly, they double in size every day. If we humans grew that fast, it would take us less than a week to grow from baby to full adult. Farms like Mike's have a dedicated team of trained mushroom pickers. Mushrooms are delicate, so they have to be careful with them. Once they've been picked, they are ready to be packed up and start the next stage in their journey to your fork. <laughs>